In this video, I'm going to show you how to charge your batteries with the iMars D300. Let's get to it. If you're new to my channel, I have a website at kevinwoodrobotics.com where I have a bunch of resources on robotics and computer vision. So check it out and subscribe to learn more. So I'm using these batteries here. It's the Z batteries, the 5,200 milliamp hour batteries. What we want to do is make sure you choose one of the channels here. So this channel A and channel B. Right now I'm using channel B. So you're not going to connect it in the wrong way because of how these holes are configured. There's only one way to plug it in. Uh, this part, if you haven't used it before, which is the balancer connector, this part can be confusing if uh, you haven't used this before, but we want to make sure is that the black cable is all the way to the left. You can see that there's some extra holes here, which you may not end up using all of them. So in this case, just make sure the black is all the way to the left. If you unplug this, you're going to see some uh, tiny bumps on the white part. You see those bumps? Make sure those bumps are face down. Okay, so after you have everything connected, uh, what you want to do is you could go ahead and toggle this, this button here, this button on the left. This will show you a different screen. So this one's showing channel B, channel A and B. So notice here in this screen, it shows you the current voltage. So you can actually charge two at the same time for this one. But what, to actually charge it for this channel right here, what we want to do is go ahead and click into this menu. So you see how right here is showing channel B. Then once you go here, you want to click on this right button here. So this will show you the different modes that you could do. And you can see here that there's a option here that says the select task so if you go into this by pressing this right button then you're going to see you could do different things you could do uh, charge discharge storage balance what i'm going to do here right now is show you how to charge so i'm going to go ahead and click ok uh, the target voltage is set by default um, so these are three cell ones and then you have the cell count so this target voltage is per cell. And then the target current, you may have to adjust it. You want to go ahead and read what your specs say. Uh, but you could go ahead and click the right button to enter this and you could adjust it accordingly. So once you have everything, go ahead and click down and then click the start task. Uh, okay, so my connector, yeah, you may see that message if your connector is not connected because it just fell out. So let me go ahead and fix that real quick. Okay, so I just fixed it right now. And now if you go ahead and click the start again, you're going to notice that this will start charging. So you see now that it's charging, right? And let's say you wanted to stop charging. You could go ahead and just uh, hold the right button and you see that now it stops. All right, so hope you hope you found this video helpful.